Okay, uh, auto annotate. So I'm a big annotator, if you notice. Uh, I've had a lot of fun annotating. So basically I want to find an annotate and then I'm going to apply it to uh, a bunch of videos. So the, um, the Google annotate that I'm looking for is how to use. All right, that's the one I want. See if it's going to work, right? All right, how to use. I don't know if I double click this. All right, it's transferring the data to um, annotate. And I'm getting this crash area. So that's beautiful. So this is an example. And here's a found up fix for you guys. Um, I actually sent an email, I didn't get a response back, but you got to, what does this mean, server error in application, right? So there's a server error somehow, I don't know if it's on your side or on YouTube side, they've been doing a lot of changes recently, um, so it could be on their side, for you, you know, and your code just doesn't match up. But you need to put this in, um, basically dumb it down, like, okay, this is what you need to do, right? Uh, description, this application occurs, server, blah, blah, blah. To, to enable the details of this error to be viewable on a remote machine, please create. So how do you create this custom errors tag in your WIG config? All right. So is this something I do? All right. All right. So basically, I don't know if they're asking me to fill something up, but um, there's a bug with that. Uh, annotate guys and I've sent you an email you didn't respond so I'm just doing a found up fix on it um, and if it's something that a user needs to do you need to first do this then do this and send us an email send a report or if possible create a little program that will basically pull that apart um, I was really looking forward to trying to use annotate because the opportunity to use auto annotate is this is basically I could sell you advertising all right and um, if I was to open up, um, and then I could stick it on, I right, sell you advertising, I could stick it on every one of these videos, which I wanted to try to show you, right? I have over 500 videos, um, and co their combined viewership is, is, is pretty, it's pretty significant, right? Um, so it would be, um, so this is, this is actually, let me see, find the one that I was, um, I think this is the one, how to use, okay. This is the um, the ad that I wanted to transfer over, I created, I'm playing around with, with, with Annotate, right? So um, I created what I thought was kind of a pretty cool intro to it. And you could play, come around, develop quite a few, and actually what you could end up doing is um, uh, sharing them or other people can copy them and do their own little things with them and and uh, create your own little ad community but I don't have any ads on my uh, you know on my uh, page whatsoever so watch it watch it come up here so the, so there is my ad coming up it still hasn't finished right boom Okay, so that's an ad. So that's this is a found ups, change the world together, and you can click on these two things. So I wanted to take this ad, right? And actually, I could, you know, I could change these here. I can come up with a basic format and change this and stick them on all my, you know, videos. So our Occupy Global solution, our open, our open startup solution. So that's what I'm promoting, right? And I want to start promoting this. And instead of me having to annotate every video, if I could just do this and then use their auto ad, um, auto annotate to actually send it to all the different videos, it'd be kind of cool. But there's an error, right? It doesn't work, unfortunately. Um, let's just pick another video. What happens if I pick another video? Is it everything or just this one video? I'm running out of time here, so we'll see. Yep. You got an error, guys. Good luck with fixing it. Hope to, hope to uh, test it in the, in the near future. Bye.